Hello! This video is about the first 6 ink PIXMA G series models G500 and G600 series. In the first video on these models, I will show the key product features. Let me start with the differences between the two models. In different regions, these models have different names, but they are identical once they are installed. G500 is a printer and G600 is a multifunctional print, copy and scan device. The printing specs are the same and so are the ink bottles, also called different names in different regions. In my video I'm using the European models. Before getting into the key features, let me remind you to subscribe and be notified on future uploads on printers. And do not forget to check the get the most out of your printer section from the web manuals. With photo printers the quality is what matters. These are 6 ink printers, all inks are new with extra grey and red color. The inks are Chromalife 100 and print on the original media should last 100 years when stored in an album. The grey ink uses neutral tones on all media types. And the red ink expands the color gamut. Let me compare with other PIXMA printers. The G600 photo quality is higher than 6 ink printer like PIXMA TS8300 series. You can find 7 videos on my channel in the link below. PIXMA TS8300 series has additional features compared to the G600 and much higher cost for photo print. The only PIXMA with higher quality is now PIXMA PRO 200, the 8 ink A3 Plus format printer and offers professional workflow and color profiling. See more on this model in the link below. Finally, let's compare 6 ink printer with 4 ink printer. There is visible upgrade in the output quality. Next, I show the capacity and speed. From the out of the box set of bottles, you can print thousands of documents and 3800 photos of 10 by 15 cm format. 
Each bottle contains 60 milliliters of ink. Here are the official print speeds and a quick test. My printer will be set up in part 3. Find the link in the upper right corner of the screen. The document print quality is ok for home or school use, but it's not water resistant like with other 4 ink Pixma G series models with pigment black or with Maxify printers which can print two sided water resistant full color documents. Find videos about these models in the description. Maintenance on these models is very simple, with user replaceable print head and maintenance cartridge. Each bottle has its own mechanical ID which only allows the correct ink to be inserted. Pixma printers are compatible with many Canon media types. As there is only one paper tray in these models, every time you change the media you need to confirm the size and type. And frequently used media types and sizes are displayed in last order used. I recommend trying different types of media and you find more detailed videos in my Creative Media playlist in the upper right corner of the screen. Also, banner print up to 1.2 meter long is supported from the driver. In the last part I quickly cover the connectivity and software. Welcome to Canon Printer. What would you like me to print? Print a coloring pages. I can print out coloring pages for children or for grown-ups. Which one would you like? For children. Printing for you now. I can also print out number place puzzles, notebook paper, checklist paper, staff paper and more. Similar with other Pixma models you can print from smart devices, using different apps and services. Scanning is only supported on G600 model and I should not open the cover during scanning. It was just for the demonstration. D6000 
These three Canon apps have been demonstrated many times in my videos and are compatible with all inkjet Canon printers. More software for computer is available to download and I will set it up in the part 4. You can find the link. Here is a short overview of the software that is compatible with the PIXMA. With G600 do not forget to install the Inkjet Scan Utility, a very nice tool with several possibilities for scanning. Poster Artist Lite is a cool software and it's also free to download. And that would be all in this video. Find more about this Pixma by getting into the get the most out of your printer or check my YouTube channel for more videos. Feel free to comment ask questions and do not forget to subscribe. Turn on the bell so you will be notified about my future uploads. Thank you for watching and sharing. Bye!